A morning, yes. Yeah. So in this video, we're going to talk about how to defeat Arlo. Um, the squad I take in may not be the same as what I'm about to suggest, because obviously I've learnt a little bit more since my battle. But Arlo is starting off with a flying and ground type. I suggest use taking an ice type in. Um, then moving swiftly on, it's either going to be Mawal, Cradilli, or Lapras. Now. Um, I would recommend taking in a Machamp simply because Cradilli and Lapras are weak to the fight type. Is Lapras weak to the fight type because it's water as well? I can't remember. Might have took a Lucario in. But yeah, either way, uh, then you're moving into Scizor, Gardevoir, or Snorlax. So Arlo is pretty much the toughest one out of the three, out of the four if you include Giovanni. So yeah, um, let's go into my battle and then um, see how I got on and hopefully we can learn together on this one what the best Pokemon to take in is Arlo the tough cookie you never lose well you're gonna <clears throat> I think I was being a bit brave with this one. Um, again, under 2,500, however, I accidentally took that maxed out Weavile in. So we're going to start off here with Lucario. I think we try and get those two power-up punches off first. Do I shield? Yes, I do. Because I have fallen for not shielding here before and... I think it was Aerial Ace absolutely just wiped out my Lucario. So we're going to let this first one slide, and the second one by the way. Get those shields gone and done, out of the way. We're one shield apiece now, I've already used one. Try and get this second power up punch off, and I do, and get rid of their second shield. Then I think I'm going to try and charge up my power up punch again, and then switch to the Weavile, which I did not change the fast move to an ice time move. So I'm going to have to be quick here, but this one is 2993, I have invested in this one a bit, I think I've got another one I've invested in a lot, Night Slash, I knew that wasn't going to be effective, that's why I didn't shield, get that ice type move off, it's going to be double super effective because it is flying and ground and ice is super effective against both types. Going into, now this is not a great matchup, I'm Sure, ice might still be super effective. I can't remember if it was, but the rock would have withstood it. So it could be neutral damage, but it's super effective, which is good. But if Arlo is finishing on a Snorlax, um, Lucario, both of them together would take that out quite easily enough. Just have to spam those um, power up punches a lot. Which can get a bit frustrating. Ah, okay then. So the dark type here is when it gets really good. And that Gardevoir has got a lightning. I forget what the what the move is. But it's an electric type uh, fast move. Which is not that, that great to be honest. Get one more foul play off. Before I'm going to have to switch obviously. Gardevoir being weak to dark type moves. Because of the psychic ability that Gardevoir has. Which you can say she, because we all know that Gardevoir is a female Pokemon. But yeah, it's safe to say we've nailed this. One power up punch should see it through. That did a very minute amount of damage. But there's Gardevoir. And that is how I defeated Arlo. I hope this video helps. Any questions, please comment down below and I will answer them. I always will. And give you the best advice I can. Um, we got 12k egg from that. And an Anova Stone. Was it shiny? No. Like I said, I hope this video helps. Any comments down below, I will answer. Ask me anything you need to. Thank you all for watching. That was how I defeated Arlo.